now we are hanging out outside uh, Topple here, uh, very close to, well actually this is the screen where Loki first met Misa, as Misa just destroys Rabbites, I really do not care what's in that chest. It is Dryad Day during the night, when I go to the next screen it will be Jin Day, which is the day that we need to make it, surprise surprise, we're gonna find a Jin spirit over here. You, it, the day kind of gives it away, doesn't it? Uh, I don't know where he spawned because I can't see him, nor can I move. What is up, Jin Spirit? How goes it? I'm Jin, a wind spirit, and I'm so spirited. I'll even come along on your journey. Sure, you do that, a smart choice. And we've received Jin, a wind spirit, which marks... Uh, no, it's still just three. I was about to say, isn't that... No, that is four! Yes, halfway point! Hooray! And we're back in Vinket Hall, down near the bottom of Vinket Hall, actually. And it is Salamander Day. Now, time does not pass in Vinket Hall, so make sure it is Salamander Day before you enter, well, the hall. Or however you want to phrase it, don't enter the house unless it is Salamander Day. We are very close to the bottom here of Vinket Hall, just right up here. This is the last save point in the dungeon here. Um, and surprise, surprise, Salamander shows up. Now we can talk to him. I, I assume it's a him. It's me, Salamander. If I spit, I'll show you what I can do. Yes, join us. Leave it to me. Whoa. And we received a salamander, a fire spirit. Now, I've not done this before. I've always wondered, what does Cal Lee have to say about any of this? Dracula, Christopher Lee, Saruman, what do you have to say about this? Dark Lord, believe it or not, the, wor the world needs him. He's just misguided in his direction. So he has nothing new to say since, well... Dark Lord's not really. Whatever, we are moving on. And now we are back outside of Scaly Lair on Undyne Day. If you remember, this was uh, where we picked up Undyne the first time, if I have timed it right. And I have. It is still Undyne Day when we head over here. And now she spawns pretty much where we got the first one. I'm Undyne, a water spirit. I'll gladly help in any way I can. Yes. A rigatoni. I still, I still have no idea what she's talking about there. But she has joined the party, and we need two more. And now it is Gnome Day, and we are on the path to Gaia. In fact, this screen up here will be Gaia's facade here, uh, the entrance to Gaia Cave. I believe it was called Gaia's Cave. And here another gnome shows up. Wahahaha, <laughs> it's me, I'm gnome, I'm a nurse spirit. Okay, if I tag along with all of you, like I'm gonna say no at this point. The obvious choice. Receive gnome, a nurse spirit. Now, it is time, well, to get one last one, and it's further this way. And we have made it through Gaia's cave. And it is Dryad Day, the last day. Of course, we saved this one for last, because I hate your puns. Even though, when I do this, you don't typically make the puns, I still hate them, because I know they're coming. So let's get over here so we can find the spirit. I'm Dryad, I'm a wood spirit, could you, could you take you with me? I'm not, gonna, I'm not even gonna say it. Yes, I'm very happy, I'll do my best. And we've received our last fifth spirit. If that makes sense, we now have five spirits across the board. So I think it is time now to head back to the cave where we defeated Marilith. Sorry, Mar Marilith? Marilith? I forgot how I said it before, but it's, it's not Marilith. I know that. We need to go back there so that we can actually turn in these trait coins. And now we're back in the cave north of Lorimar where we fought Malaris, I believe is how I said it before. And here, we can finally talk to this guy, Florent! Which coins have you brought me? I brought you light coins. Wow, congratulations, you have collected ten light coins! The coins, please! And then I received Wisp, a light spirit. Now I'm just gonna do the rest of these off-screen, because really, all he changes is what 
coins I give him. Everything else is the same. And now I have upgraded all my spirits so that I have six of each of them. Which means I have a lot of work ahead of me. Why? Because there's only two more upgrades that we can get. Uh, there are a total of eight spirits that you can have for each. So, I need two more. In order to get the seventh one, though, I need to do quite a bit of grinding. I need to get each and every one of these spirits up to level 30 as you can see I've been putting them off because it becomes a lot easier to level grind with them when I have you know six that I can use at a time as opposed to one it just goes so much faster uh, as you can see I'm still waiting for that level up I'll try to get that on screen as well because uh, when we put that last mod into thief it should uh, it should do something. I, I sure as hell hope it does. I've never actually gotten it uh, to work before. Uh, but I think I will meet you when I do have all the necessary requirements. When it comes to the spirits, as I glide along here, I'll probably be doing all my grinding uh, in the glass desert. I'll have fun, I swear! Okay, I am back. I've been doing a ton of level grinding, and I am not even close to where I need to be. But as a result of my level grinding, I did finally get that level up. Unfortunately, it didn't work the way that I thought it would. I have put 40 points into Thief. I thought that automatically gave you an accessory. However, it did not give me an accessory at all. So just know that I now have more than 40 points in Thief. Uh, however, I have not obtained anything. As you can see, I have a couple of the spirits up to level 30. This is after a couple hours of... Uh, level grinding with the spirits. I don't know, to be honest, how soon I'm going to be able to get those done. I might, and I, I really do not want to do this, I might need to hack my way to victory, and that's something that I'm not looking forward to doing. I will try, I will try to get this done legitimately, but it looks like I have a lot of work ahead of me. We are in uh, the path to Gaia. It is, as you saw, Mana Holy Day during the day. We're one screen south of the entrance of Gaia's cave. Why are we here? For this guy. This is a light cyclops. I'm going to use my sword because that's probably the best thing that I got against him. Da Damn it. How dare you hit me? Die, light cyclops. Just, there we go, knock him down, and down he goes. He was not that tough. Now, the this is a light cyclops. He has a chance of dropping a, a an arrow light, uh, which was one of the things that we have a quest to do. He was pretty tough. He's no longer that tough now that we're at this point in the game. I don't care about the treasure chest. When he's on this screen, he has a 5% uh, chance of appearing, but if you get... Uh, him to drop a chest, he has a 92% chance of giving you a jack arrow light. So I'm going to keep killing enemies on this screen until I get that jack arrow light. Now I misspoke in the last place, I apologize, it is not a jack arrow light, it is a jake arrow light. Now we're here back in the glass desert and on this screen during a mana holy day at night in the glass desert which is uh, one screen to the north and then one screen to the east of ish we can find this guy this is the dark cyclops now uh, same encounter rate same uh, whoa just let's avoid that same uh, like I said same encounter rate same drop rate as the light cyclops unfortunately he didn't drop a chest he also drops jake air light not jack jake i'll meet you at the next screen I'll, I'll give you a hint there are eight of these guys and now we have encountered the next cyclops this is the moon cyclops because it's well it's Luna Day at night. We are one screen north of the entrance to the Altar of Time. This is where all the polter chests are, the polter boxes. Sorry, uh, there are the polter boxes, I believe. Either way, we need to kill this guy. Uh, he, wow, she charmed him. <laughs> 
he shouldn't be this uh, that tough for us anymore that oh, we have the brownie ring you do need to watch out for the magic though and down he goes did he drop the chest he didn't he will drop the HAL Aerolite, but of course, there are other people to drop that air Aerolite. There are four kinds of Aerolite in this game, so two of each of the Cyclopses. We'll, we'll drop whatever Aerolite you're looking for. So I'll meet you at the next one, and I'll make sure I get a HAL, aer HAL Aerolite from him. And we have encountered our next Cyclops. It is Jin Day. During the day, this is on the way to the other uh, Cyclops that drops the HAL Aerolite. This is the Wind Cyclops, of course, being Jin Day. He has a chance of dropping the Vinek Aerolite. Uh, he can appear on one of four screens. Uh, I've gone to the ones... Okay, so you land at the Rocky Wilds Armory. I went down, right, up, up. And that's how I got here. You can also go down, right, up, left, down, right, up, left, up, down, right, up, left, up, right. And he'll appear in all those places. I went to the one that was easiest for me to remember, which was down, right, up, up. And she is leveled up. Very nice. She lo And she died. Apparently this guy is tough, so we will take him down, and I get a level up, and he didn't drop the Aerolite anyway. Time to head to the next one.